What is best in life? To crush your enemies, see them driven before you, and to hear the lamentation of the women. All right, we have tonight our round one playoff match in Twitch Blood Bowl League. <coughs> Season 12. Uh, my Amazon against S Hunters Norse. I am not for sure who is at home. I think it's me. Yep. <coughs> so, let's go check out the teams. <coughs> He's going to be giving me a lot of inducements. He's at 2170 currently. He has a full roster, all 16 players, if I remember right. Yep. <coughs> Yeti with block. Yeti with a lot of shit. Block, stand firm, mighty blow, um, juggernaut. Both ulfs with block. One is armor nine. That's an interesting skill up. And then one is guard. Uh, one thrower. Yeah, one thrower with uh, leader. And two runners. Both are dodgers. One is sidestep and sprint. The other's just dodge. <coughs> And then both Berserkers, one's Mighty Blow Piling On, one is Mighty Blow Piling On Tackle, Move 7, and Juggernaut. And then he has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 linemen. Three rookies, one with Kick and Strip Ball. Yeah. <coughs> and then an Armor Boosted one with Finn. Again, I'm not sure I understand the Armor Boost there. One with Strength 4. And then one with tackle and one with tackle wrestle. So he's got three tackle to help deal with uh, my Amazons. One coach, one cheerleader, ten fan factor, three rerolls. <coughs> so his coach and cheerleader will equal out my coach and cheerleader. <coughs> I have no money. He's ten fan factor to my nine. <coughs> so pretty close there. I have a 14-man roster, but I'm missing three, so I have 11. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. But he is giving me, and we're in my stadium, which is weather is always the same. <coughs> and he is giving me uh, 6, 10. <coughs> yeah. Lots of money here. This is going to be an interesting match. So... Don't really know what's going to happen in this one. <coughs> All right. Um. That's all good. <coughs> all right, so we're just waiting on him to say he's ready. We're to send the invite, either one. <coughs> Have a feeling this could go pretty badly for me, but we'll see. <coughs> I think the other match in this uh, division is getting played tonight, too. Ac Acropolis and... Voltron, I believe. And the two winners, winner of that match and the winner of this match, will play each other for the U.S. side, for the championship on the U.S. side, and then the champion there will play the champion of the EU side for to be uh, crowned the Grand Emperor. <coughs> and, yep, that's it. So let's take it. <coughs> And we got 600k we got to spend here real quick. <coughs> so let's see who we can get star player wise. We can get Helmet with a bribe or two. We might do Bertha. Mighty Blow. <coughs> Thick Skull. Break Tackle and Dodge. Roxana. Hmm, that's interesting. 250. Sorry, it doesn't really do me a whole lot of good here. She'd still be decent, but... How am 
much is she? 270. <coughs> A bribe. A helmet. A helmet, a Roxana, a bribe, and a wizard. 8357. She's leap, which means she only fails on a one on leap. <coughs> Juggernaut. Then the opposing players may not use their fin stand for wrestle. <coughs> Yeah, I think I'm gonna try Roxanne. I've never I don't think I've ever played with Roxanna before. <laughs> so it'll be interesting to see how this goes. And <laughs> every dwarf that's worth any kind of a piss, when they get knocked down, I will be fouling with helmet. <coughs> Since I have the bribe. <coughs> Kind of stacked. <coughs> he wins and decides to play offense first. That's fine. <coughs> All right, what are we going to do here? <coughs> She'll come off the line. She'll come off the line. Fuck, who the hell do I put on the line of scrimmage? Jesus. <coughs> ah, she's niggled, man. I really don't want her to be up there because she's niggled. <coughs> Six, nothing. <clears throat> um. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We got a rookie, the mighty blow, the sidestepper, fend. <coughs> there. He's got one pylon, right? Yep, yeah, him. <coughs> no, he's got two pylon. Shit. Um, I rolled a nine. He rolled an eight, so nobody gets fame. We ended up tied. Yep, nice. So it's straight up roll on uh, coaches and cheerleaders because we both have one apiece. <coughs> All right, well, let's see what happens. I have a feeling this could be ugly for me, but we'll see. You never know.
<clears throat> All right. <clears throat> Even if I am able to pull out the win, it's potentially going to be uh, a very hurtful match towards me where I would not have a full team to have fun with in my next one. <laughs> uh, it could be nasty. We'll see. <clears throat> We shall see. <coughs> yeah, he's going to do the hit with the guard here and keep the guard so that he can do that play there. Or he could just try to go. No, actually, that's what he's going to do. He's going to take her out and then go that route and then go that route so he gets two potential pile on hits with these two here. If he piles on, he's getting fouled with one of them. <coughs> with my chainsaw. If I can free him up, he will get fouled. <coughs> Didn't I have a kicker? No, I don't have a kicker. He does so. Ooh, nice. We likey likey. <laughs> we'll take that perfect defense. It gets us away from at least getting the, the two soft, easy hits from those two. And he'll only get one chance at a guy that he's got to get a pal on. <laughs> That's my strength, too, right? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> And he had to use his movement of his guy there to get the guard in there, so we're happy with that. Keeps him waste that makes him waste that movement. Nice, no break on the first hit. <laughs> oh, he does break there though. Oh, and an injury. Jesus. Well, that didn't take long. An eleven and an eleven. Wow. <clears throat> Problem is, he's got way more players than I do because <laughs> he's got a full fucking bench. Uh, so I am not going to win the player attrition war in this one. <clears throat> so I got to make my plays count. I got to make the wizard count. <clears throat> <clears throat> we like. Is he really thinking about re-rolling it? I was going to say. <clears throat> crazy if he does. Come on, don't move. Really do not want him getting right there. <clears throat> nice! <coughs> oh, he does? Oh, nice. We will take that. Um, Sidestep here. Oh, he juggernaut. He juggernauted. 
That's why he didn't. Uh, that's why I didn't get to use Finn. He juggernauted. <coughs> but that's going to give me a free hit on him. Hopefully, hopefully this guy doesn't move. that. So first things first, let's do this hit, see if we can take him down. We do. Beautiful. Oh, damn, why couldn't I break him? Get him off the pitch, please. Yes. It's a big takeoff there. That is a big takeoff there. Baby, do not kick back. <clears throat> Come on, helmet. Do me some good, baby. He did not kick back. That's good. Now crossing. Ah, oh, just a stun. Darn it. Still not bad. Good, perfect. <clears throat> I couldn't just stand up because he could have surfed me. He could have frenzied, bam, hit me here, and then hit me there, and then he frenzied break me Break yourself, out. fool! <clears throat> That's right, break yourself, fool! Break yourself, fool! Cell phone. What's up, Ivy? How you doing, my friend? Well, I got one of his killers off. That's good. I didn't get the one off that I wanted to get off, though. This one here. <coughs> I expect, uh, fully expect the blitz with the tackle piece here. <coughs> but we shall see. He might go after her since she's niggled. That's what he's going to do. Oh, no, that's not what he's going to do. Interesting. Oh, he's going to blitz with the uh, Yeti. <laughs> yep. Oh, and he gets the pal. Damn it. Just a stun, though. We'll take it. <clears throat> we'll take just a stun. And we'll take that he's wasting his blitz there with the Yeti. We're okay with that. We'll get a mighty blow hit on the tackle piece this next turn. Nice, nice. We like that. Um,
<coughs> if he screws around and gets in too close a range, I'll potentially lightning bolt and leap over with Roxana to get that ball. <coughs> potentially. Oh shit, he is too. Interesting. So I could go one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. But I don't have anybody to really get to the ball unless I go here. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. There's no sense in quite doing it yet, I don't think. Besides, I don't have... Oh, wait a minute. If I just lightning bolt and that ball comes out, I can just do that. And then she can run down and I can pass to her. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, and then pass over to her, which means I'd have to get some guys around here. <coughs> do I do it now? This might be the best chance I really have. I think I'm going to take the chance now and just see what happens. Oh, I got the bounce that I needed. That's good. All right, so he'll just stand up. up here because if I don't he can blitz but I have oh he's got juggernaut shit 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 I did not pay attention to juggernaut one two three four five six seven eight pass up I'm going to do the foul first because I have the bribe and just hope I don't kick back. Nice, I didn't kick back. That's good. <coughs> just a stun. Come on, no one, baby. Nice. for it. Whew. Oh, and I rolled the six, too. <clears throat> Hopefully I got in there enough to block up this Yeti. <clears throat> no, I didn't. He can still get through. <clears throat> oh, nice. I rolled the six on the pass. We'll take that. <clears throat> No takedown there is good. He can get to me with some players, but I marked up both his tackle and I cro or uh, KO or stun that tackle. Everything else he's got a 
get a pow with. <clears throat> or a juggernaut to get me out of... No, because I got sidestep. Juggernaut only cancels fend, right? Not sidestep too. Opposing players with fend stand from a wrestle. Yeah, so sidestep I can still get out of the way. <clears throat> as long as he doesn't get a... But he gets three dice with him to get a pow, so... <clears throat> Take that. He's got a frenzy in follow. He should have went this way and got his Yeti over here where he could potentially get a hit on him. That's nice. We like that. <coughs> no pal. Oh, he gets the pal. Damn it. I needed him to not get a pal there. Son of a bitch. <coughs> <coughs> <laughs> yep. And the good thing is, is I'm sidestep, so I can sidestep too closer to the end zone. <laughs> Come on, no pal. No pal. Of course he gets the fucking pal. Unbelievable, man. Uh, let's get closer. He didn't break. That's good. <coughs> Surprised he left that. Oh, he's going to just dodge out and try to pick it up with him. <coughs> Yeah, that's what he's going to do. That is what he's going to do. Ha! Ha! He's going to try to do the go for it and pick up. Fails to pick up, so there goes re-roll. Come on, double fail it. Oh, he gets it. <coughs> well, I could potentially... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, with two go for it to get to him. Don't know if that's exactly what I want to do, but... <laughs> down there because then I could have got the two dice on him. Well, that sucks. Um, no tackle, no tackle, so I could dodge out here and go there. He could dodge out and go over here, which would get me two dice there. If I knock him down, then I could blitz up there. <coughs> or... have a whole lot of choices here. <coughs> I almost got a blitz with him, unfortunately. Five, six, seven, eight. So two go for it's or I do the three plus dodge. Two go for it's are better. So <coughs> let's do this Let's actually just go ahead and stand her up first. Let's do this one die first. Nice. Ah, just a stun. 
Just a stun. Darn it. I'm going to do the... <coughs> I'm going to just stand him up for now. Try the one die here, or I could try the dodge out here. I need a couple of two pluses here. Ah, oh, I failed to go for it. Son of a bitch. Uh, I gotta take a chance here and try it, right? Well, failed the loner. Uh-uh-uh. I shouldn't have done the two dodges first, because the two dodges would have made my two go-forts that I was going to do. <coughs> so I wasted my, my rolls doing the dodges first. That stinks. <laughs> now he's going to get a jump up hit and piling on hit on him, which sucks. Um, which way do I go here? Oh, I'm thinned. Nice. Dodge, yes. Fend, yes. Where do I sidestep here? If I sidestep here, that forces him to go that way. If I sidestep here, it forces him to come back around this way. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go here. I wish I'd have followed here now because he's just gonna come around here and get that easy, easy assist to get hit on my mighty blow piece. Not good, man. Not good. with the Yeti to make sure he moves. <coughs> What's up, Satterfield? How you doing, man? Oh, wow. He went there instead. Okay. Oh, he's going to blitz with the Yeti there. Inter oh, nice. That's a big wild animal. That is a big wild animal. <coughs> oh, and he gets the pal though. Come on, man. Really? And he breaks. Oh, and he goes. Damn it. That's a big piece for him to get knocked out because of the fucking guard. <coughs> and the sidestep to go with it. <coughs> but now he doesn't get two dice here. He can get one die both times if he moves her up like or this guy up like that. <coughs> Yeah, because he's got 16-man bench. <clears throat> he shouldn't have that many for Norse. At, at the absolute most, Norse should have 14. At the absolute most. Plus, I'm missing three players. That took away a lot of my, my uh, team value. My team value is normally around 1,800. <clears throat> Everything's going good, man. So he's going to use him for the assist. And then he's going to use him to take the, uh, the assist away there. 
but he's going to leave his guy open here if he does. <coughs> I need this ball carrier to fail this dodge is what I need. Oh, he's just going to do straight up one dice. No yellow there. Come on, baby. No yellow. No yellow. Oh, nice. Use that reroll, baby. No yellow. Yeah. And he had to waste the reroll to do it. Beautiful. <coughs> B E A Beautiful. We like it. We like it a lot. <coughs> oh, she's Juggernaut Frenzy. Nice. Feel that dodge. Feel that dodge, baby. Ah, oh, damn it. Should have dodged her out. I could potentially frenzy this guy. Oh, you got the tackle on me. You lucky ass. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I could potentially frenzy with a couple of go for it. Yeah. <laughs> so, first thing we're going to do is we're going to come down here. We're going to get this mighty blow hit here. Ah, gosh darn it. Crap, that stinks. I should have moved her there because then I could have got the hit with her. Ugh, screwed that up, didn't I? If I don't follow, no, I have to follow. <clears throat> Just got to take a chance here. He's going to surf me no matter what, so. All right, well, this is it right here. Just need two pluses. Nice. That was a big one because he had tackle on me. Oh, I didn't want the pal. Well, actually, the pal does not hurt me too badly. As long as this ball bounces good for me. Bounce good for me, ball. Don't go out of bounds. Oh, it went out of bounds. Damn it. And it went way the fuck over there. Shit. That sucks. It could have threw it back over here for me. Fucker. Nice, that's a big make. Reroll that for sure. Unfortunately, if it would have went one square for less, and I could have been marked on it, which would have been nice. <coughs> but we're still not in bad shape here. Six. Yeah, he can mark me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He can get to the ball with the sprint. He's down to one reroll left, though. That's nice. We like that. <coughs> yeah, and here comes the surf. I had to follow, though. Well, actually, I didn't have to follow, but if I don't, then he could have one-die blitzed me with him to surf me. But I don't think he would have done that. With the way things played out now, I know he wouldn't have done it, but... <coughs> Sometimes it is what it is, right? Nice. No take down there. It's beautiful. Damn it, he gets the pal. 
Fuck me, man. Oh, he's got Juggernaut. I forgot about Juggernaut. Shit. Now he can frenzy me. Well, doesn't matter. He can't surf me now, but he'll pile on. Maybe he might not now. Nope. Nice. We'll take it. That means she's safe at least. See, I think I'd use the thrower there to do that. Yeah. And then try to do the go for it to get him on the ball. That's probably your better play. Uh, you could do that, I guess. <laughs> Is he just gonna, he's gonna try to get to the ball with him, I guess? Shit. Another. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yeah, we'll take it. Take that. Yeah, that's the move right there for sure. <coughs> I need him to not get there is what I need. Like that. Come on, fail one of these. Make him use that reroll. Ah, makes them both. All right, so I got one chance here, really. <coughs> I got one chance. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Five, six, seven, eight. Four, five, six, seven, eight, four, five, six, seven, eight. Come on, Roxana. Keep being a star for me, baby. So let's see. Yeah, that's gonna be a four plus. No, a three plus. Does she have pass? No, she doesn't. Does she? Shit. So three plus or a two plus two plus. Three plus is sixty six percent, eighty eight with the reroll, but he is on. Or a two plus, two plus is sixty nine percent, ninety two percent with the reroll. But it is another roll that I'd have to make with the loaner. Um. I think I'm just going to actually do the 3 plus plus. Because I did a lot of rolls there with no 1, right? I did a 4, a 6, and a 2, and a 2. So I'm pretty sure a big roll should be incoming here. With two twos in a row. Pass is good. And catch is good. Nice. Nice. He was too worried about trying to keep that other catcher over there from dodging out, and he didn't do anything with Roxana at all. Whew. And I get both of the KOs back. That's good. He doesn't get his back. That's good. And we use our bribe here.
<clears throat> he does still have time to score back, though. So, first things first, let's get the chainsaw off the pitch. And we'll... Oh, my eyes. Eyes are burning. Get her up here. Take him out. So we're going to make him make some rolls here if he wants to get hits on us. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Bam. Put her over here. Put our other side stepper over here. Protect Roxana here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We got mighty blow sidestep. Bam. All right, we'll go with that. Yeah. Well, the failed anything would hurt because she's loner, right? So, the 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 point is, the percentages were a little bit better to do the the go for it and then the two plus two plus pass, but that's three rolls as opposed to two rolls. And the third row doesn't matter because the third row has a built-in re-row with catch anyway. So it's the first first row that matters. So I either do a 2 plus 2 plus with loner or I do a 3 plus with loner. The 3 plus ends up being better, right? Because in the long run, I think, because it's one less chance to fail to have to use that loner re-row. So when you add that in, that changes the numbers up a little bit. <coughs> Right. He was too busy worried about trying to uh, surf my, my killer instead of putting the Yeti over there with the, uh, the disturbing presence. I would have done the same thing. I would have put the disturbing presence over by the ball. I would have blitzed with the Yeti over there to get that, that disturbing presence there and forget about trying to surf me. And that's the thing. A lot of co And S. Hunter's a good coach, not saying anything bad about his coaching or that he did this specifically, oh. but a lot of coaches get so enamored with trying to surf people that helps a lot. That slows him his chances to get his this tying score here. But some coaches get so enamored with trying to surf that they uh, they screw themselves up in positioning later on because of it. <coughs> and he potentially hurt himself there by trying to get himself to where he could surf. And he was trying to get to where he could surf two players. Because if things would have worked right, he could have surfed two players there because of the juggernaut. Nice. No breaks there. It's good. But he's going to get the pylon hit here. <coughs> Let's hope he doesn't get yellow on both of them. On either one of the two friends, or the hit and the frenzy hit. Yeah, now he's only got two chances to score, so he's got to worry about... He does get the yellow, though, unfortunately. He's got to worry about getting some guys downfield in range to potentially score. Good pylon. Yep. Yes, we'll take it. Arcani? Arcani? Thanks for the follow, man. Welcome to the Spider Family. How is your night going? Hopefully well. So where's he blitz now? That's the question. I think I think what you do is you just blitz with the Yeti just to make sure he can move and get him down here closer in range, right? You don't even have to blitz to hit here. You just blitz with the Yeti to get him down closer. Five hundred and ninety-fourth follower. We're getting close to that six hundred mark. <coughs> At this point, you just got to get a couple of guys down here in range. Well, more than a couple, as many as you can. I'm glad I lined up here because that doesn't allow him to get the full range of movement out of his players this turn. 
One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. <laughs> and if he does move to six, he's got to leave guys marked, which is going to let me get free hits on him, which he doesn't want to do. <laughs> so this was a perfect lineup here, especially for the riot. Perfect lineup. <laughs> That's the one I really got to get the hit on with the dodge. <clears throat> Oh, wow, he didn't blitz with him. He just, oh, he's going to do the actual blitz with him. Interesting. I did not expect him to go that route. I would have blitzed with the Yeti to make sure he could move. Yes, he has to use his reroll right here. He No, he doesn't, actually. Well, I wouldn't have, but... And he doesn't get the takedowns even better. <coughs> even better, baby. Oh, and he didn't follow. That's going to give me the opportunity to get the blitz on her anyway. Now, fail to pick up. Oh, damn it, he got to pick up anyway. Shit. <clears throat> I think we're actually going to be good here. Um, we're going to move him in here. He sidestepped Fen. <clears throat> He's got to make two go for it anyway. I'm gonna bring Roxana into here. We're gonna reroll that. Perfect. make the go for it there. I don't have that fucking reroll, man. But if I do and get that guard in there, then I can do the two-die hit on him. So then it's just really a matter of him. Which means he'll blitz here. And then I just sidestep if he takes me down. Yeah, I don't know what to do here. I'm going to do the go for it here first. Beautiful. So this doesn't matter through here now. He's going to open that up. Potentially. try to hit her he's not in range and can't do nothing so he hits her and then he frenzies with him and then he's in range to score right <coughs> Dodge here. He can't score. So he can. He can if he gets freed up, which he could. If I go in here, that gives him a one die. Yeah, let's do that. She's niggled or just strength work? Just strength work. Uh. Ah. 
Well, it was worth a try on that dodge. If I could have dodged her out and got her over here, that would have been huge to mark him up. Then it would have forced him, almost forced him to have to go this route. <coughs> the question is, which route is he going to go here? Because if I knew which route he was going to go, I'd sidestep her closer to that route. He's going to try to go this way, then when he hits here, I'd sidestep. Well, I could, if he moves in there, I couldn't sidestep there, but I'd sidestep there and then here. Try to slow things down a little bit. He can't dodge out. He's got to go straight through unless he dodges this way. But he can't dodge backwards. I think I've got her, this guy marked off enough that he's almost got to go this route. And he's out of reroll, so that's good. Surprisingly, it's been uh, very gentle as far as armor breaks and takeoffs go. A KO for me and a, a cross for him. A couple of KOs in, the, in that first drive for him too, but I got them both back. But this, the way our teams are skilled up and the way our armor is, obviously, with armor 7 across the board, one would expect to see a lot of uh, carnage and red in this game. So far, we haven't seen that. <laughs> All right, so he's not going that route. Oh, and he gets the pal. Come on, man, really? Ah, that sucks. He's getting he's getting quite a few pals with his non-tackle pieces, and that sucks. And a break. Shoof, just a stun. All right, so that means he's definitely going this way. He moved the way I didn't want him to move. Damn it. Oh no, he's gonna try to hand it off to the uh, to the wolf. Interesting. Come on, fail to go for it. Uh, oh nice, no takedown. No reroll for it either. Beautiful. Oh, he's got juggernaut. Shit. Um Let's go into a one die. Nice. And if we go here, then that means. Nah, we'll still just go up here. We'll make We'll make it to where he can't hand it off to him like he wanted to. <clears throat> so he made his go for it, but he didn't get the yellow, which is good. I forgot about the damn juggernaut, man. But this this does give him the free hit with him now on the sidestep. Or the, uh, with the, uh, frenzy. Oh, is he going to foul? Surely he's not going to foul, is he? Oh, no, he wanted to get the hit on Roxana, and he gets the pow. Damn it. Come on, Roxana. Survive this, baby. Survive this, baby. Yes. I, mean, I didn't necessarily have to have her in, uh, in the second half, but it would help. <laughs> help a lot. It would help out a lot to have her. God damn, I wish he'd quit moving without fucking doing an action. That's twice now he's done. Three times, actually. Three times this half he's moved without making an action and made his wild animal. He's only, In fact, he's only wild animal one time this half. That sucks. <coughs> nice. No pow there. We like that. No pow there. Um, let's actually, let's come down. Nice. Either way, I still got guard on him, so. Um. Let's go there. Fine.
He's coming around here. Oh, he's... Ah, shit, he can't come around here. He can come here, though. Damn, no blitz there, man. That sucks. Uh, that really sucks. That's really who I want to blitz with. All right, so let's blitz this way, then. Oh, come on, get him out of the game. Get him out of the game, baby. Yes, KO's good enough. That's a roll he's got to make. And that was a tackle piece, too. Now let's see if we can get this leader out. Come on, baby. Take this leader out, baby. Come on, baby. Out of the game. Oh, KO's good enough. Another reroll he's got to make. This dude. This is the one I really, really, really want to get out of the game. Come on, baby, cross. KO's good enough. Oh, I forgot she had jump up. Can't really get to two dice on him, but we got the reroll, so. Oh, nice, we got the yellow one. Is it worth doing a foul here? The uh, eight plus? I'll still have 11 to start the next half. Chance to get a piece out that could be a pain in the ass. Yeah, let's do it. <clears throat> Come on, baby. One more guy. One more Norse guy off the pitch. One more Viking or on? Nope. And I didn't get caught though. That's good. Oh, I rolled a seven. If he didn't have the armor break, armor boost, I'd have broke him. <clears throat> That was a very good first half. That Roxana was definitely worth the money, and the wizard was worth the money. Oh, he gets three back. Wow. Damn, that sucks. Hopefully the killer didn't come back. Uh-uh-uh. All that work I did. Nope. The leader didn't come back, though, so that's good. He loses a reroll. All that work I did to get all them KOs, and they came back anyway. <clears throat> but at this point... Uh, yeah, it sucks. He was still going to have 11 guys, though, so it didn't matter. <clears throat> but 
at this point, what matters is that I score. If I score here and go up 2 nothing, then it's almost assuredly game over. Almost. Oh, I didn't even mark down. Who, who scored? My strength boost busted catcher scored. Pinello. 45. Yeah, she scored. Gotta mark her down real quick. <clears throat> All right. Yeah, I figured he would do that. Exactly what he just did. And that's fine. I can get hits on all three of them. Oh, wow. If he leaves him there, I was going to say, if he leaves him there, he's going to die. Or he's going to get taken off the pitch. Because I will foul him with the chainsaw. <clears throat> better protect both of them fuckers. I will absolutely foul him with the chainsaw. I still might. I still might just blitz his ass with the chainsaw. I think he realizes if he leaves him like that, I can get a two-die hit on him with only one go for it with a mighty blow piece. With a mighty blow piece. All right, so let's see here. First of all, thrower goes back. Roxana comes on. She comes off. All right, so we'll get Mighty Blow there. Card here. Over here, damn it. <clears throat> All right, so what do we got here? We got Mighty Blow, Mighty Blow. Our other Mighty Blows over here. Hit there, hit there. and then foul with him. All right, let's see what happens. No perfect defense. That would really fuck me right here. All right, we'll take it. 
stadium came in handy. Oh, ball almost went out of bounds. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, that's fine. Oh, yeah, this is the guy I wanted to hit with. But if I don't take him down. So before I do that, let's do this. Yellow. Uh, I'm re-rolling it. Fuck it. There we go. I don't want that guy getting any hits on me if I can keep it from happening. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Nice. Don't have to worry about his ass the rest of this game. Unless he apos him. Would not expect him to, but you never know. It's a big, big takeoff. He does use it. <clears throat> Does use it. That's all right. Okay, so now. All right, let's do some hits here. Nice break that I was not expecting. Kickback. Plus four on the foul. Break in. I get caught. Hey, I got some money's worth out of Helmet, too. He did several fouls before he finally got caught, so good job for Helmet. And it keeps this guy, this girl here, free to move next turn, so that is a very good first turn right there. This is what I expected he would do, which is perfectly fine. What I really need is I need for this guy to stay far enough away from me for being able to affect me with the um, disturbing presence. <coughs> I think he's going to blitz with the Yeti over here, though, and if he does, then that's not what he should do because that gets the disturbing presence completely out of being able to uh, affect me in any way. It's just going to come down to me being able to make passes and catches. He's... Oh, wait a minute. The Yeti can't do anything. He's got to move there. I forgot about that. Okay. Never mind, then. <coughs> Never mind, then. 
Interesting that you'd go that route. There's no guard there. It's a one die. Huh. He's going to do the one die. That's interesting. Wait a minute. How did he get two? Oh, never mind. The Yeti's the, uh, the assist. Forgot about the Yeti being an assist. We're going to let him have the free hit here, but it's going to keep him marked. Oh, yes. Dodge through there, please. Free me up right there. I would absolutely love that. Nice. And he failed to dodge. I would not expect him to re-roll there. And he doesn't. Okay, so now the question's going to be... How do I pass here? If I go out to here... See, I got accurate with add it, which adds one. Pass lets me re-roll. So that's one, two, one. So that's a two three, four, or if I just go straight here, one, two, right, sorry, two, three, four, or if I get here, one, two, so I can't, I can't, I gotta blitz one of these guys off, I think. Two, three. Um, so how do I want to do this? Taking a big chance doing this. <clears throat> oh, and that's why. God damn it, that's why. Oh. <sighs> do I do the other go for it? I really need to get this mighty blow hit on him, man. Gotta do it. Shoo! Oh, thank God. Break him, please. Break, 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 break him, please. Yes! Big time, baby. Big time right there. <clears throat> Ooh, and an armor break. Nice.
Yeah. Mm. Eh, I'm not even gonna do it. Alright, so we got a pass with Pinello. Or with the thrower, sorry. Lulu. Her 27th pass. And we got a cross with him. With her, I mean. Tifa. Or catch, sorry. Or Kaz. Lulu. I'll get it right one of these times. Puts her at 26. No, she's at 28, so she must have had another Kaz earlier that I missed. At some point. Yeah, I figured that was coming. Now you can get the hit there. He's got to get a pal, though. Big turn for me, though, because I got a cross there and a KO on the Finn guy. So he's down to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. <clears throat> big, big turn for me right there. No pal, no pal. Oh, he gets a one die pal. Kiss my ass. Wow. How in the fuck does he get the one die pal? Seriously. Unreal. Oh, I forgot he had strip ball. Oof. Yeah, that was bad. I totally forgot he had strip ball. I would have played that differently if I'd have remembered he had strip ball. I would have just ran my thrower back and got out of range. Oh, and he gets another pal. Come on. I guess I can't complain, really. Not with the way the dice have went so far. That is the one thing that has went good for him, is he's gotten a lot of pals without his tackle pieces. Now, I'm still not in terrible shape here. <clears throat> and he gets another one there. No break, though. That's good. <clears throat> he's got to dodge out here, right? Dodge out and come over here and get the guard in place, or get him in place with the guard there. Almost has to. But I'm still in good shape. The fact that he didn't break me on any of those hits makes puts me in really, really good shape. Oh, he didn't dodge out. Wow. That's interesting. Thought for sure he'd have dodged out there. He'll just stand. Blitz is going to come here. Here, so I can get the mighty blow hit on this jump up piece. Get him away from Roxana. Nice. Nice. They're all KOs, but hey, we'll take KOs at this point, right? <clears throat> Oh, another nice break. Oh, and an injury. Wow. That's a big one. All right. Well, now what the hell do I do? I guess I could get my guard over here. Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> double one the dodge. Yep. Double one the three plus dodge. Even in the tackle zone, that was a three plus. But can't complain. Cannot complain at all. I didn't break myself, which is even better. Yeah, that's all he can do right here. And he fails to dodge, of course. Got to re-roll it. <laughs> Does make that. And then into a skull. Alright, now who do I score with? I think I score with her, right? Yeah. Definitely gonna try to score with her, so... Let's get the guard in here. That gets us a hit here. Uh, string four guy. Nope. <laughs> it took four girls for me to get the two dice with her. <laughs> That's hilarious. That is hilarious. But I'm, I'm, I'm pretty confident that it's safe to say I've got this game locked up. He's got one, two, three, four, five guys left on the pitch. So all 16 of those Norse did him no good. Because you can only have 11 on the pitch at a time, right? And when that happens, that doesn't make any difference at all. Well, that one wasn't there. He's there because I crossed him and he used the apo. But those four standing there just watching on the sidelines doesn't do him any good. Doesn't do him any good whatsoever. <laughs> Oh, you can get two dice on the uh, sidestepper now. Oh, no, he can't get two dice because it's the guard pieces. I forgot about the guard. Just let you stay right there. Oh, he's got Juggernaut. Shit. <coughs> Forgot about the Juggernaut. Now he can get two dice. And of course he gets the pal. <laughs> ah, that's so awesome. And he broke me. <coughs> yep, which I turned into inducements that paid off. Exactly. That's why it's not always... Uh, necessarily the best thing to have that many players on your bench. <coughs> Sometimes it doesn't do you any good. Sometimes it does not do you any good. <coughs> Break yourself!
hate doing this, but... <clears throat> Actually, I didn't need to do that, did I? All right. I did not need to do that. And there he is. What's up, my friend? Thank you for the host, and welcome into your 64 Raiders. Nice. Very nice. Thank you, thank you, thank you, sir. Oh, shit. I wanted to push him the other way. Damn it. Damn it. I wanted to push him the other way. Oh, well. That'll work. Watching the Amazons put a butt whipping on the Norse here in the first round of the playoffs in the Twitch Blood Bowl League. There's another pass for my thrower. Which means I will get to score with the Mighty Blow Blitzer that I wanted to try to score with. That should get her up to 11 if you score. Yep, perfect. Now, what do I want to do here? So the Norse team that I'm playing had, I have a 14 girl roster, but I was missing three girls this match. So my TV was down from 1800 to 15 something. And he has a full 16 man Norse roster, which is a little unheard of. Most people won't go that, ro that far. Um, and because of that, he was getting, because of me missing three ladies, he gave me 510. 560. 510, I think. He gave me over 500 in inducements. I think it was 510. And uh, <clears throat> he can get two die blitz now with the tackle piece. Um, oh, he still chose not to go that route. Well, he can still blitz. He's just going to do it that way. Yeah. So I took Roxana, who has been an absolute stud this game. A wizard who helped me score a defensive touchdown in his half. And helmet with a bribe. And Helmet got off four fouls, five fouls before he got caught. Um, so he received first. He came over on this side. I lightning bolted his runner that had the ball, which was this runner here. Doubt he rerolls it yet. Which was this runner here with the sidestep dodge sprint. And once the ball was out, I got one of my catchers around the end here. I leaped through with Roxana, picked the ball up, and then passed to the catcher. He was able to get the ball out um, and then pick it up with his runner. And then the next turn, he ran backwards with his runner. And the turn after that, I was able to dodge and blitz with Roxana. I was going to surf the runner, but I got an open pal on the first hit. So the other runner, which was a dodge runner, um, this one here. Got the open pal, so I went ahead and took it. Ball threw in over here. Next turn, he got around the ball with one guy and protected up some of my other guys over here. But I had a catcher here that I ran over to the end zone, and then Roxana came through, leaped in, picked the ball up in a tackle zone, dodged out, and then made the pass in the end zone to score. So I got a defensive touchdown. Um, let's see here. What do I want to do? He's going to stand up for the hit here. Uh. <clears throat> and then a riot he was going to have three turns left to try to score back but a riot came but take from them everything lurking zoe thank you for the follow much appreciated um he i really want to get her over here but that's all right he um Yeah, let's just do that. He, uh... Tried to get guys down to score and was not able to. And we went into the half 1-0 uh, with me up. And then this half I've gotten... A couple of cross. Uh, I got a cross on this guy. Used the apo, and then I got a couple more crosses, and then three KOs. The one KO was still out. Uh, and I've got him down to what? Five guys on the pitch, I think. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, five guys on the pitch. So. hit on 
machete, see if we can break him with a mighty blow. Nope. That's alright. We'll get him out of the way now. And we like it. We're in really good shape. Uh, let's see here. Lurkin Zoe, thanks for the follow, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, how is your evening going? Welcome to the Spider Family. Slade, thanks for the uh, raid. And welcome into your viewers. Hopefully everybody is having a great night. Oh, honey. His, his dice in the first half weren't terrible. Mine were good. His dice this half have been bad, and mine have stayed good. The one thing he has done good, or well, has gotten a lot of pals with his non-tackle play pieces. He has done that. But he hasn't been able to do any damage. He did the one, one badly hurt here, I think. And that was at the very first, I think, turn one. So yeah, it's it's been a it's been a very good good game for me so far. <clears throat> so how'd your night of Blood Bowl go in there, Ian? Hopefully well. Assuming you were doing some champ slider stuff. So the way the Twitch Blood Bowl League works, for those of you that don't know, there's a European side and a U.S. side with several leagues in both. The top tier league in both is called the Emperors. And uh, he goes ahead and does the one die and he rolls the skull. Oh, jeez. Oh, and he breaks himself even better. Um, it's called the Emperors. So the top two teams out of each Emperor, or sorry, the top three teams out of each emperors, U.S. emperors and European emperors, emperors, all play, uh, make the playoffs on their round. And then the next league down, which is, um, which is Lords, the winner of Lords gets to uh, go into the playoffs as well. <laughs> um, gee, can't get a yellow right now. There we go. So that gives you four guys in each bracket. Uh, the three from Emperors and the one from Lords. Of Lords. Oof, there's an injury. Nice. Oh, that was for my thrower. Oof, and an armor break on his tackle piece. So my thrower, Lulu, with the casualty there. Her fifth casualty. All right, and then that will leave us with... That's my blitzer. Yeah, that's my blitzer. So let's go ahead and... One, two, three, four. Let's blitz here. here. So then what happens is you have a four-man playoff roster with um, on each side in Europe and in I don't want to score here because one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. just going to come on over here. <clears throat> I don't want to give him two turns to get hits with this killer. I only want to give him one. Um, so what happens is you have a, a four-man bracket on the European side, a four-man bracket on the U.S. side. Those two brackets play completely out. He gets another pal. That sucks because if he breaks, he didn't break good. If he breaks, then I can't get enough guys down here or assist down here to, to hit him and blitz off. 
Um, so those two four-man brackets play out, so there's a winner in each. And that winner is crowned U.S. Emperor and Whoa. European Emperor. And then those two play each other for the Grand Emperor, title of Grand Emperor. So this is one of the two matchups on the U.S. side. <coughs> wow, did he just dodge out? He did. <laughs> nice. Failed dodge there. He probably rerolls. Nope. Saves his reroll. All right, so we can get a... This is good, because we can get a Mighty Blow hit to try to get two SPP and then score the touchdown. And then just in case we happen to fail, we're gonna run everybody out it's back to safety so we can't get a hit on any one of these girls. So maybe if I get lucky, I get a yellow here. I do. Beautiful. Hopefully I can break him and get across and get two spot SPPs on the way out. Nope. Uh, so close. Mighty blow on the armor break. Double ones on the injury. But I will get the three for the touchdown, which is big. And he gets three out of four again. So that's twice now he's got three out of four on the KO rows with no babes. Wow. That is craziness, man. All right, let's let him kill on uh, Roxanna here because I don't care about her. Don't care about her anymore. Where'd I, oh, let's say, where did I miss a hole at here? All right, and then up here we got our Strength 2 Fender, our Rookie, and Roxanna. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and I scored with Riku. <clears throat> nice job, Riku. Gets her up to 11. Now, if the MVP would fall on her, then that would level her up this match, which would be big, big, big. Yeah, Roxana was a lot of fun. That's the first time I've ever played with Roxana. She is well worth 250k. She is really, really good for 250. Cryo Cheese, what's up, man? Yeah, and the only reason I haven't replaced her is because every match the last two seasons, I've lost 
multiple blitzers that have been really good blitzers, and I've had to spend all my money replacing them. Right now I'm at 0k. I don't have any money because every every other match I've had to replace a blitzer. And the blitzers are way more important than a strength two sidestep fending, blodging catcher, right? And she's she's still annoying as fuck with the sidestep and the fend, right? And uh, and she gets, I mean, I get my use out of her for sure. Oh, what's up, Taco? I missed that you said uh, something earlier. My other catcher's a spitting image, but she's not strength broke. She's blodge sidestep fender as well. So both of them are the same. The strength two sucks, but she's not normally doing hits. She's normally just, I'm, I play a little reckless with her. I put her in positions where she's going to get three dice against her, and if she gets killed, she gets killed, right? It allows me to tie people up with that sidestep fend and really just be an annoyance, which is what she normally does. <laughs> Sooner or later, she'll take care of herself, right? Not much you can do about that. Yes, we'll take dodge. Oh, he hit with this regular frenzy. And, oh, and he gets them both down. So here comes Pylon Mighty Blow hit number one. Just a KO. We'll take it. That means she's good and safe. Yeah, it's been a it's been a fun game. I was really scared at the beginning of the game because he had three tackle pieces and the two mighty blow piling on pieces. But my turn one, I was able to take this one off right off the bat, and I fouled him a couple times. wasn't able to get him off the pitch, but I did foul him a couple times to uh, keep him on the ground where he couldn't do anything for the first four, 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 yeah, four turns I think. And that made a huge difference, right? <laughs> There's a cross on uh, Roxana. Bye, Roxana. You did good. Thank you for the money. Or for the for the good play for the money. And there's another pal there. She and she just she is she's one of those that actually has like strength or, or, or armor ten. She hardly ever gets broke, man. Zons are really good if you're playing against a team that doesn't have all, a bunch of tackle. You play against Chaos Doors and Doors though, and it begets it begets uh, or becomes a, a tough match. <laughs> yeah, attack when it was a good plan because it forced him if he wanted to blitz her, it forced him to have to dodge and either make two dodges. Or make a dodge and two go for it, which he didn't have any rerolls. So the more dice I make him roll, the safer she she's going to be to still score the next turn, right? <laughs> Zons are fun. I love Zons. Oh, that is so nice. I need the money so bad. Now for the next match. Oh, oh no, that's the wrong one. Damn. I thought my Mighty Blow Blitzer got the MVP for a second, but it was the guard side stepper. Which is okay. We'll take the we'll take the MVP on her. That's good. Because she doesn't have Mighty Blow, it's going to take her longer to get to that uh, next level anyway. So now she's only 10 away. Uh, but that is win number 26 for the team. 26 wins, uh, 3 draws, 13 losses. The money is more important, and even more important is for the next round of the playoffs, which is only 2 more matches potentially. But the next round I'll have my full roster in place. Thank goodness. Because I'm either going to have to play the Chaos Dwarves that put me into the state I was in for that round, which was minus three girls. Or I'm going to have to play, and that's Voltron's Chaos Dwarves. Or I'm going to have to play <coughs> Aecrop's uh, Killer Chaos, I believe. So let's look and see what we got here. I don't think we leveled anybody. We did not. But we'll have our full roster back because we were missing, for that game, we were missing this rookie, Lenny. We were missing Aerith, which is a rookie with move broke now. And we were missing Queen Brane, which is a blodging armor broke line woman. These I don't mind about because they're just going to stand on the line of scrimmage and take hits anyway and just get pounded on, which is fine. Good enough for me. Getting that 60k is huge though. I'll have my full roster for the next match. For the finals on the Europe or the US side, which is big. <coughs> It does boost my TV back up from, I think I was at 1,500, I think. 
now I'm at 1730. See, I was at 50, 100, 120. So I was at 1610, is that right? Yeah, I was at 16, I was at 1610. And he was at 21, which gave me 500. Yeah, he was at 21 something, 2160 or 2110, I don't remember, or 2120, I don't remember. I was just over 500 though, I remember that. So, in any event, let's double check our totals here, make sure we're right. 541, 1. 43 for Freya. So what does Freya got? I missed a casualty on her probably. 27? No, that's not right. Freya. Four casualties. Yeah, she's got five casualties. So that's where I missed on her. Alright, so 5, 43, 1. 29, 11, and 0. 0, and 64. 45 and 45. Wow, the catchers are exactly spitting images. Same SPP, everything. The only difference is the strength break on the one. Uh, 21, 17, 11, and 28. Perfect. All right, so we're good. So roster is all caught up. We got our 60K there. So now we can go look and see. I think the other match was playing tonight. I don't know if they're done yet or not. They're not. So that's the two key teams. I'm going to have to play one of those teams. The Evil Anvils is Voltron's Chaos Dwarves, who I did beat last week. But he did put three of my girls into uh, Miss Next Game status. So, um, yeah, so 6, 11, 12, 13 man roster. Uh, a little bit less TV than me. And then the Chaos of Acropolis, which is a crazy goofy chaos team but he'd be giving me a lot of inducements too if i played him he's got a 13 man roster he's got a block dodge guard minotaur i have not played this team yet so i this would be the first time we meet up he's got a beastman with 30 player he's got a beastman with block jump up mighty blow he's got a beastman that's move broke with tackle and wrestle he's got a killer beastman which won't matter to me with the claw anyway um he's got a tackle guard block beastman so only two tackle pieces which is better than could be. Uh, another Mighty Blow Claw. The Claw means no difference to me. Um, <coughs> a Block Beastman. A Beastman with Strength 4. Blodge Guard. That's a really nice looking Beastman. A Niggled. Edge Boosted Blodging Guard Beast. Chaos Warrior. Well, that's Chaos Warrior. So an Edge 4 Chaos Warrior that's Niggled. Blodger, too. That's going to suck. Uh, Chaos Warrior with Blodge, a Chaos Warrior with Block Stand Firm Guard, and then a Chaos Warrior, another Edge 4 Chaos Warrior with Block Dodge Guard. Man, a lot of Blodge. A couple of Edge 4 Chaos Warriors and a Strength 4 Beast. Man, this is this is a pretty nasty looking team, actually. <laughs> he's finishing off your team now. Nice. Oh, he's going to win. It was a draw. Gotcha, Voltron. Well, I just skated through safely with, uh, I don't know if you watched the whole match, but I skated through safely against uh, the Norse, so. Did you do any damage to him at all? Is he going to be missing anybody against me? I guess I could pull it up and see. Let's pull it up real quick and see where they're at and what's going on. Acropolis. And we'll end the recording on this. The stream will keep going, but for the recording, thanks for getting on and watching. We'll see you next week in the next final round, uh, or the U.S. final round of the uh, TBBL playoffs. Lo, there do I see my father. Lo, there do I see my mother and my sisters and my brothers. Do I see the line of my, my people, people back to the beginning? No, they do call to me. They bid me take my place among them. In the halls of Valhalla, where the grave may live.